to another edition of Gaming Night. Tonight, this episode is um, called Beer and Pretzel Games. Um, so, I'm going to start off the Beer and Pretzel Games with uh, one of my recent uh, purchases. And uh, I'm going to, this is a new uh, series where I'm going to be taking apart some light games that are really quick and easy to play. Talking about them very briefly. So, uh, to get right into this, we're going to start with uh, Ninja vs. Ninja. So, what you get here uh, is a really simple rule, rule book. Really simple. Get a really simple rule book. Um, real simple uh, game board. Some four-sided, uh, some dice that got a little sorted them. They're four-sided. So they have numbers one through four on them. It is kind of more like they're just average four-sided square dice. So instead of six, they're just four. One through four. Then you, each of you guys get a ninja of your color. A ninja a base of your color and a shadow ninja and a point marker so that's what you get in the game really simple so I'm going to uh, do a quick uh, solo play show you how it plays out and that's it alright this is how you play uh, Ninja vs Ninja so we're going to assume the uh, the black ninjas are going to go first. For all sake, um, you're going to roll the die. So, seven pieces. Um, seven, you move one piece. Seven pieces, uh, one spaces. One, two, three, four, six, seven. So, you can move all the way up to seven. So, six, seven. So, on his second turn, before his third turn's over with, he's got to be back on this side. So, I move my, uh, Shadow marker here, so means he can score one point. Now your opponent will move. Overall, we get a five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Put the side to stay there, and then he's got to get. He scored one point. And he faces back right there. This four five. Five. And he's staying right there. Four. Well he landed on that space. Exactly. So he's that's not that he's dead. So you can win by either getting your points to seven or killing the component the opponents. Now for movements you can make one L shaped uh, movement. For example um, one, two, three. So pretty much keep going until someone gets to seven or one side's eliminated. It's a rather simple game. It's more of a beer pretzel type game. So, it's not really all that much to it. Okay, my overall opinion on this game. Ninja vs. Ninja is a two-player game. And, um, it's a good one. Not a great one. It's good. I would say it's it's a beer and pretzel game that you would play when you're waiting for your gaming group to arrive and you only have you and someone else. You're all set up for your gaming. It's also good if, uh, your gaming group canceled and you want to play a quick game with somebody, this is a good game. 
to just to pick up and play. I would only recommend this if uh, you can get over the fact that it's really simple. Not really not much to it. It's a fun game, but I wouldn't warrant as a go out and buy it. But overall, I did enjoy it. I just think that it's not the greatest game. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, my Ninja vs. Ninja uh, thing, you know, it's, like I said, it's very brief. But by all no means, this is not a bad game. So, it's, like I said, it's not going to feel for it to everybody.